Today we're announcing an even greater expansion of vaccine eligibility. Probably the worst kept secret in the history of secrets. <laughs> Exactly one year after the first person in Louisiana was diagnosed with COVID-19, the state is taking a big step in protecting the most vulnerable from contracting the virus. Good evening. Thanks for being with us tonight. I'm Dan Jovic. Jackie is on assignment this evening. Thousands of additional people all across Louisiana now qualify to receive a COVID-19 vaccine. NBC 6's City Simone is live at LSU Health Shreveport sharing our top story tonight. City? Good evening, Dan. Anyone age 16 and older with any underlying conditions on the CDC's list of qualifications can now sign up to get the vaccine. We are constantly being bombarded by people saying, hey, can I please get the vaccine? Can I please get the vaccine? And we can only give it to those who are eligible. Many medical professionals across the state are excited about Louisiana Governor John Bell Edwards' new expansion of vaccine eligibility. More doses means more appointments, but Lisa Babin with LSU Health Shreveport says they're ready. We probably will have some overwhelming days because, you know, this is a, a large age group of people to become eligible at one time. Patients under 18 are only authorized for the Pfizer vaccine. The new list adds more than 20 illnesses which make you eligible in this phase. So people will need to brew, uh, bring, say, a prescription that shows they have one of these conditions, you know, a diagnosis. Um, that they have this condition. Babin says having access to a large number of vaccine doses and more testing sites allows Louisiana to progress faster. I think the governor is, is very compassionate and very sympathetic to those who really are worried for their lives because it's proven if you have an underlying health condition that you are more likely to become very sick if you contract COVID. With the number of fully vaccinated people increasing, healthcare workers say we should still proceed with caution. It feels exciting, but I hope that we're not going to feel like we crossed the finish line too soon because I think it's much more important that we stay focused on doing the right things than celebrating too soon. For a list of vaccination sites for this week, visit ArklaTexHomepage.com. Reporting live in Shreveport, Sydney Simone, NBC6 News. That's good news. All right, Sydney, thank you very much for that.